Greetings, RC. RC Model Geeks. And here we are. In the shed, yet again. Well. <laughs> part eight. Yes, that is correct. Who'd have thought it? Eight ah. parts. Yes. It ain't finished yet. Not yet. So, uh, it's four o'clock already. Oh, yeah. Um, and, uh, well, yeah, we've been we've been working on stuff, haven't we? Yeah. You know, just, um, you know, sort of dipping around doing things. Um, what have we really done? Oh, we put the engine back on. Yes. Uh, so that is all uh, connected up and wonderful. Um, we also um, they came up with an idea that isn't perfected yet. Yeah, ongoing. <laughs> ongoing, using those um, spring-loaded thingies again, those uh, oiler things. Yeah. And I turn this round. You can see it here. This is going to be, when we get it right, and it's not right yet, our uh, filler for filling up uh, the fuel. Yes. Right. Um, this is the Mark I version, which didn't work very well. Mm. It didn't seal well enough. So we've got to work on a better way of sealing it. I, I did actually 3D print some uh, some TPU uh, as a seal to seal that, but it doesn't really work well enough, so we're still working on that. But basically the filler pipe will end up going on there. <clears throat> and then inside here, I don't know if you can see it, we'll put another pipe. I don't know if you can get down there and see that, Carl. Yeah. Try, try and tip it up. Open it up. And, yeah. Um, Might be able to zoom in. You see, there's a pipe inside that filler. So yep, when you it. come to fill it, basically you just push the pipe on over that internal pipe, and uh, there you go. Fill, 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 fill. Like you fill your car. Yeah. All right. Um, the only problem we've got is either there's too much back pressure in the exhaust. Or um, it just doesn't seal properly because mm. uh, fuel is coming out of there when the engine's running. Which, oops, given the game away. Oh, damn. We've run the engine today on this. There <laughs> we have. And uh, do you know what? Let's uh, show that bit of video now and then we'll come back and talk some more. Okay, well, here it is. Probably should have to give her a little, a little squirt or two. Mm hmm. Oh, I'm running. Been running for about 30 seconds. Right, so let's uh, see if we can get this baby running. We've already run a tank through her, um, so we we're just doing the running at the moment. Next one is we've got to run full power, um, rich, basically, for the whole tank. Yeah, nothing wrong with cheating.
So there you go. That was a bit of the running in uh, process. Hmm. Um, it, it runs very nice, that engine. It runs exactly like the other Sato. Once it's fully run in, we can get it tuned. At the moment, you've got to run it rich. Um, uh, you know, so it's not going to tick over really beautiful slow, is it? But when we mm. first started it, it was mega slow, wasn't it? Yeah, it was tick just over. like... It was like boom, 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 yeah. boom, boom, and it just kept going. Um, very nice, very nice indeed. But you'll see that once it's uh, once it's all run in and it's all tuned up mm. properly. Um, the good thing about running stuff in, of course, on the ground is uh, a vibration. Yeah. So it gives all you know everything a bit of a shakedown. As we found out. Didn't as, we? as we found out, yeah, the nose leg. We taxied it around for a look for a giggle. And the nose leg uh, actually came loose, hmm. um, so we've uh, we fixed that as well. The, um, the the steering rod part of it, yeah. So that's fixed. But everything else seemed all right. Everything it? else is fine. Yeah, for it all worked all right. Everything else works fine. Um, yeah, I mean, there's not a lot really to say, is that I'm still thinking about uh, changing the push rods so that they're proper uh, clevises on both ends mm. and that will probably get done this week sometime mm -hmm. um, but you know we're 90 98 percent there if we really pulled our finger out we could go and fly this but mm. it still needs running in a bit more so yeah yeah um don't want to you know bugger it up just for the no. just for the hell of flying it you know no, what i mean right. yeah. you don't want an engine cut or anything like that while it's still you know, running in. Mm. Um, yeah, but I mean, that is it really. It's not a long video, is it? Um, obviously, I did another cutout in here. Oh yeah, for the to, uh, to clear that uh, that spring-loaded filler. That's got quite a few cutouts in it now, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's like a Swiss uh, cheese, isn't it? But they're all. Yeah. But it's all good. Yeah. All right. Um, like factory. But better. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I mean, you know, uh, end of the day, we've just been experimenting with ideas. If they work, they work. If they don't, they don't. Mm. But, you know, it's just having a go, in it? See what we can do. Yeah. Um, still got to do the other filler cap thingy on the other wing as well. Oh, yeah. Um, but that's not a major issue. No. But, you know, it's trying out an idea, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, I'll tell you what would look nice on there. What? A woody prop. Yeah, it wouldn't have had a wood prop, though. Wouldn't it? No. Oh, it's too too new. Yeah, it would have had a woody, I don't think. Ah, oh, okay. Um, yeah, so um, um, what, what's their plans for this thing, Cole? We've, over the next couple of days, I'll probably just do a few bits and pieces to it. You're not yep. around, are you? No, no. Um, um, and I think I'll finish running the engine in. I mean, I might take a bit of video over the next couple of days. If yeah. I, find something important or whatever uh, failing that probably the maiden eh? yeah well I'll be back on uh, Thursday well we think we're doing an evening aren't we yeah we're doing an evening I could bring the big camera over yeah yeah I mean you know that's like it we would we could have technically flown it today yeah um, but a we ain't got the right camera with us mm. for for like in air shots yeah um, and so we thought, nah. And then it's like, well, actually, it'd be good if we did this, 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 and this to it as well. Yeah. So uh, get it right rather than just, you know, do it for the hell of it. Yeah. So, yeah, there you go. Like, comment, and subscribe. There is no more today. No. <laughs> it's another short one, so you won't fall it asleep is. by the end. No, that's right. Yeah, if you're lucky. And if you. And how much? How much video did you shoot of the running? Uh, oh, no, I'd have a guess. Three minutes. All oh, right. Well, you can block your ears up for three minutes then as it's going don't forget to hit that oh, like what? button you know what I've just noticed put the, put the bloody uh, nose leg back on the wrong way around oh yeah haven't we um, yeah it should be at the back have a look on the drawing on the picture yeah yeah no I'm just 
thinking. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, I have fucked up. Oh well. There you go. Anyway, like, comment, <laughs> and subscribe, and we'll see you all in the next video. Thanks for all the comments. I haven't read them today because I put the video up quite early this morning. Mm -hmm. uh, enjoy. Yes. So it's goodbye from Mad Colin. And it's goodbye from Captain oh, Rob. Stop doing that. See you all soon. Yeah. Bye. Thank you for watching Captain Rob's RC Model Geeks. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to click that like button. If you want to see more of the same type of videos, don't forget you can subscribe. If you want to support us, you can use PayPal. PayPal.me forward slash RC Model Geeks. If you want to contact us, you can email us rcmodelgeeks at gmail.com We look forward to seeing you in the next video.